It smells like tang. Tang! Hey, it's a cake in a glass! Last time we used a hammer to scrape off the paint, and that worked fine. But it's not working so well on our new wall. So instead, we're gonna use this stuff. So we're gonna do all these things, and which is basically, in short, you paint the stuff on the wall, then you slap a sheet on it, a sheet of plastic, leave it there for uh, half a day or so, and then you peel the plastic off. So a lot of people aren't really sure how important is the plastic sheeting. We're gonna put plastic sheet on this side, no plastic sheet on this side, and see which one wins. I'm just gonna pour this stuff in this normal paint tray here. It smells like. All right, we're gonna put it on the wall without the plastic. And don't be stingy with this stuff. You want it to go on pretty thick. Okay, see how my wall is nice and orange? That means we're done. We're gonna do the same thing to this wall and cover it in plastic and see how it goes. You probably noticed I'm wearing glasses. If you like your eyesight, you should too. There's not, there's not a whole lot of technique to this. You just wanna get it in there. in a roll and whoa I got a lot of this stuff I have my whole yard in this jeez Place it sticks really good. But just like I said with the painting, this does need to be pretty, it just needs to Needs, needs to be on there. All right, so this is what we've got. We've got this side painted without the tape, or without the uh, plastic. We've got this side painted, which is better, with the sheet or without. Well, let's get to it. Peeling off this stuff does make a giant mess. So this will be fun. Okay, well, the 
paint obviously didn't magically peel off. What do you think? It's all right. I mean, a bunch of paint definitely is coming off. But I'm not quite exposing the underlying brick in the way I want. If you read about the, these paint strippers, you'll see them claim, like, removes 37 layers of paint, and all this stuff. And uh, I've got, this is like two layers of paint, and it looked like it, it looks like it removed the top layer. Try not to get it on your hands. Or wear gloves like a smart person. I'm not being smart right now. So you can see I've cleaned off a few of these bricks, and you can start to see the brick underneath there, which they probably haven't seen the light of day for 50 years or more. So this is pretty good. Um, it didn't magically peel all the paint off like I maybe wished it would, but hey, what are you going to do? I mean, the key to happiness is low expectations. All right, let's check this out. Paint's coming off. Oh wow, look at that. Similar situation. This actually worked just as well, or almost as well, as with the plastic. And I didn't have to put plastic on it and pay for the plastic and put it on and take it off and who wants that? Okay, well, also a little disappointing. I'm gonna call it a tie.